Our reporters have you covered on the big visit weekends at Mizzou with Sean Williams, Tennessee with Ryan Callahan, and Texas with Hank South. Sean, take it away. Yeah, Missouri's got a big SEC showdown with Auburn this weekend, and they won't have a lot of visitors in on campus, but they, the one significant one they'll have, they'll be taking an official visit and is uncommitted currently is Toby Hastrub, the rising senior edge rusher out of Texas. Obviously, phenomenal story with him. Uh, you know, born and raised in London. He's come over here to the States. He's played uh, soccer his whole high school career until this year is his first year playing football, and he's racked up a bunch of power forward offers. He's just coming off an official visit to Boston College last weekend. Missouri will get their chance to kind of woo him this weekend, but he's going to be pretty busy. He's going to explore all of his options. He's got official visits lined up to Ole Miss, Florida State, Texas Tech, and Virginia after this Missouri visit, so we'll see what happens there. That being said, now let's head over to Ryan Callahan at Tennessee. Thanks, Sean. Massive recruiting weekend expected at Tennessee with the Vols playing host to number seven, Alabama. It's a huge opportunity for Tennessee to get a number of players on campus across multiple classes. And it looks like this weekend is going to live up to the hype in that regard. An impressive list of visitors headlined by some official visitors, including four star class of 2025 defensive lineman Isaiah Campbell. He's a top 50 prospect nationally out of Durham, North Carolina, a former Clemson commitment. And since he reopened his recruitment last month, Tennessee has been widely viewed as the favorite to land him. So it goes without saying, this is a big opportunity for the Vols to maybe continue to build on their momentum and start to push that one toward the finish line if they can impress him this weekend. And then in the 2026 class, four-star edge rusher Rodney Dunham, another highly ranked player, out of the state of North Carolina that Tennessee has had on campus before, now a chance to impress him on a game day with what should be a great environment inside Neyland Stadium. Now let's hear from Hank South over at Texas. Thanks, Ryan. Um, yeah, huge weekend on deck in Austin um, for Texas and Georgia. Dozens of top commits, targets expected in attendance. Um, you know, I think one guy to watch that's that's most intriguing to me is Justice Terry, the five-star defensive lineman from, from Manchester, Georgia, a guy that Texas really hasn't started to take a swing at until the last few weeks. Um, got him to come in on an official visit this weekend. Um, obviously, a one-time USC commit, a one-time Georgia commit. You know, the Bulldogs are favored right now in the crystal ball to get him back into the fold. But, you know, we'll see what happens with Texas this weekend if they can make some move, make a move in his recruitment. Um, obviously, they're still on the search for some interior defensive linemen. And then, of course, uh, Michael Terry. You can't not mention him. Second visit this season, the five-star athlete from San Antonio. A guy the Texas likes on the offensive side of the ball, kind of been compared to a Jordan Whittington, Jatavian Sanders, Roshan Johnson type. Um, big time target in Texas would obviously love to, um, you know, get get him on board in this class. Obviously trending on the crystal ball, but still battling Oregon and Nebraska for his commitment. Thank you all. You can check out their sites for the latest on your favorite teams and find out how these visit wins or how these visits went. Our guys, they do talk to the prospects. They give you their thoughts. Also, be sure to check out new to the network, powermazoo.com.